In the 1980s, Richard Felder and Linda Silverman began looking at the varying learning styles of engineering students. The overall goal of their theory was to aid students to better understand their best approach to learning which would then in turn lead to more effective learning and studying and also to aid educators in providing guidance and perimeters on the most effective teaching manners to best reach students. They identified that the learning style and the teaching style paralleled each other. They recognized that a learning style was composed of a two-step process. First, receiving information. Information would be received through either an external methodology or an internal methodology. The external mean was received through senses, while the internal means was received through introspection. Second, processing information, this step would occur through memorization, inductive or deductive reasoning, reflection, action, introspection or interaction. Their learning theory was based on the works of Young and Kolb as they identified five areas that contributed to learning. Active and reflective. Visual and verbal. Sensing and intuitive. Sequential and global. Inductive and deductive. These five areas are part of a continuum 